not happy within your life and you are a respectful piece. Hey guys, so I look not presentable. Like, I wanted to make this video because, oh my god, I'm just like, it's not that I feel guilty. I wouldn't say that's like the word per se, but I feel, maybe it is guilt, I don't know. I feel ashamed. I feel alone. This is not pity me. Um, if I cry, ignore it. <laughs> Just tired of this, of everything. And you guys can make fun of my bed all you want. <laughs> People constantly make fun of my damn blanket. It is an off pink, like grayish color. A few moments later. Um, that's how I bought it. And people think it's dirty. No, that is the color of my blanket. Sure, Jan. Always looks like this. It is pillows, blankets galore. It's just a wild place because that's how I like it. Sure, Jan. I love just laying on a lot of blankets and a lot of pillows. And yes, I wore makeup today and I've wiped my eyes at least a million times so now you just see like makeup residue my hair yes it's a mess it hasn't been washed in about a week I'm just saying things that I know people are already gonna pinpoint so okay so you already started yeah it started hello hello hi anyway hi <laughs> anyway so, so Do not do this. Do not do this. <laughs> Off of the day. It's not really frumpy, but ugh. I just feel kind of like one of them days. I think I am going to get like a sweater or something. Green sweater. We actually are about to go to car place because... We need to get our oil changed in the car. So that's what we're gonna do. Okay, so uh, we are sitting in the um, line to get our oil changed. And speaking of cars, the other day, I got a piece of mail in the mailbox the other day that just made me go, ah, so this is what's been going on forever. And nobody, I have taken the car to two different Walmarts to see what's going on with our tires because the uh, the one on the driver's side keeps going flat. Like, not really flat, flat, but losing a lot of air pressure and I have to keep putting um, air in it. And I'm going to be dead ass. So cute. She surprised me with this. Oh my god, I'm excited to wear those. I got her this choker, though she don't like it. <laughs> Even though it's Hocus Pocus. I love me some Hocus Pocus, but look at that eye. It's kind of like creepy. It looks possessed. And she also got me this journal. She's so sweet. The moon made me do it. I love that. And it's like velvet. Thanks, babe. Um, and then the last thing I got is this awesome tablecloth. Yes. Look. Although we don't have a table. I am not this person. I am not this person. This per I see some edamame, some peas, edamame, edamame. Oh wow, okay, okay. I'm a little blurry because it wants to see you. Are you gonna like? There we go. Hi. It wants to see you. Ooh, girl, I like it.
do like the whole um, cart. Should I like look down or what should I be doing? Okay. Let me see it. <laughs> Uh, what in the world? Oh. Shawty got a big old booty, yeah. Twerk, yeah. Take it ass. Twerk, yeah. Let me see you on twerk. Shawty got a big old booty. Let me see you. Put it on. Put it on. I can. I I would go back down. <laughs> Becky stole your mashed potatoes. Cook. I took a bite of the mashed potatoes. Ricky is amazing cook. Sorry, I'm trying to you. It's just you cook things I don't really like. Yeah. Healthy. <laughs> Becky always gets like awkward to say venti. I don't understand why. Because I forget the sizes like tall, grande, venti. Like I can't remember what they all mean. <laughs> I, I think tall. Um, Becky has built some things since we moved here, but this on a whole new level. The instructions have no words. The reviews on Amazon did say that building this is hard. Uh, but if you can't do it, it's okay. You're not like a builder woman. <laughs> Sorry. It's good. You just like ate that cup. What do you think? Let me try it again. That's just an excuse. You can eat the kitty cat like a champ. So if you guys remember this game that Becky was obsessed with, she's on level 900, oh wait, 997. Mm -hmm. There's only a thousand levels and she's about to be on the a thousandth level. How do you feel about this? Accomplished. Hi Amber, absolutely adore watching you and Becky. My question is, do you and Becky plan on getting married or engaged? Much love all the way from Europe. Oh damn, it's spouse it's supposed to be a video form. Oh no, it's okay. Um, I don't know, because I'm not proposing. <laughs> no, it has to be me. So I break out now just washing my hair, like, on my face. He <laughs> was copying me. Thanks. I think I'm ugly though, so. Man, Cannibal Ducky keeps giving two dollars to say the same thing over and over. Ugly. Ugly. You're not ugly. Think, think, think. So I'm not vain person. Like I don't. I think I'm ugly. So it's like I literally think I'm ugly person. I'm looking at myself right now, and I'm like, I am ugly. I think I'm really ugly. I think I'm like grotesque and like monstrous. So Twinkie Jewel! Twinkie Jewel! I miss you! I love you! I love you! I love you! Two hours later. Every time I say I love you to her, that's what she does. So I've been having a fun old time with the fur babies, but can we just appreciate this choker? It has a little moon on it, and I think it's just too cute. It's too cute. So, Becky and I was just talking. If she could only eat three foods for the rest of your life, what would it be? Soft food in my mouth. <laughs> my favorite foods is pasta, spaghetti actually, or tacos, like Mexican. But if I had to literally pick only three things to eat for the rest of my life, I would pick chicken, broccoli, and like... A form of potatoes like mashed potatoes or a baked potato or something like that because you're eating these th three things for the rest of your life you know if you chose something unhealthy then you're going to gain a lot lots lots of weight and it's gonna be a bad deal but if you choose something you know relatively healthy and you still like it you know you're still getting to enjoy yourself whilst you know not killing yourself if you could only eat three things for the rest of your life, what would you choose? Perfectly cooked and seasoned salmon. Definitely a form of rice. It has to be perfectly cooked. It just like some rice does not taste good and other rice I'm just like, yes. So obviously like uh, whatever is like 
my most favorite rice, which I can't think of right now. And then I was sitting here, I was like, oh, I should do a form of like a vegetable, but then I was like, nah, ice cream. So salmon, <laughs> rice, and ice cream. <laughs> what if you had to eat all of it together? If I had to eat it all together, no, honey. <laughs> I would choose a vegetable. Sure, Jan.